our bakery is really based on using old-fashioned techniques, um, good whole grain bread. All our bread is made for sourdough, you know, for yeast, and um, it's based on l long fermentation of the bread to give it lots of good flavor. All of our breads have some amount of whole grains in them, and many of them are 100% are whole grains. We also really try to get as much Alaskan ingredients in there as we can, which is a little tricky because we can't grow wheat in Alaska yet, at least wheat that is good for making our kind of bread. Um, but we do do an Alaskan barley bread. The barley is grown in Delta Junction. We do a couple of potato loaves. One is a 100% whole wheat potato pan loaf, and then we do a potato chive loaf, a little hearth loaf. Um, we also do an onion rye. We're doing that this week, and that's got Alaskan onions in it, um, and a, a Alaskan cheese and roasted garlic bread. So it's fun. It, it's just so neat to be um, connected with the farmers market and then connected with those ingredients, those Alaskan ingredients, as much as we can. You're right next oh, yeah. to Fire Island. I remember the very first time we sold bread at the farmers market, and we woke up the next like morning, Sunday morning, and I th said to Dan. This morning, there are people all over Anchorage eating our bread, and we know them. You know, they came to us and they bought the bread from us. And I, I will recognize their faces, and, and over the winter, I get to know their names because then they, we, we sell over the website. And uh, so I, I get to talk to them, and I know a lot of them, I know their favorites. I see when they're coming, I know, oh, she wants the rosemary bread, or oh, here she is this week for the fruited almond. And, um, so it's neat, it's just a connection to my, to my customers, and I think they like that connection with me too. They know they're baking their bread, and they know I'm making it with love and care and lots of time. It's, re it's really a special connection.